There's snow in the yard. Beyond the low wall that surrounds the graveyard, the ground falls away. The village lies 400 feet below. The view is breathtaking. So, um, there are, uh, gravestones. You see Brother Martik, Brother Valen, Sister Constine, Sister Lenora. It looks like all the graves are, uh, uh holy people, people that were served at the Abbey. Nothing fresh. Um... Uh, is the abbot a church? So you're looking for a fresher That's gravestone. The abbot is the is the takes care of the abbey. In the abbey. So there is one gravestone that looks different. It has a. Uh, it's got roses and bears and a three-inch diameter sun-shaped indentation on the east side. The name Petrovna is ground into it. A ray of golden sunlight breaks through the clouds to the west and shines upon this grave. The fog and the gloom shrink from its brilliance as the sunlight causes the gravestone to crack and crumble, revealing a ring within. So the gra so as you approach and start exploring it, the sunbeam comes down. So and you find a magical ring in the in the in the dust of the gravestone. Yes. Yeah. You put it on. Yeah, I definitely. <laughs> you reach down and you grab this ring. Very unusual, right? It's a ring of regeneration. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Perfect. The rest of the graves do not seem strange. The the guards seem to seem outraged that this has occurred. They're like, how dare you defile our graves? You guys are so beautiful and strong. Thank what was so that? Much. The abbot must be doing something. Let's go check. There out must the be abbot. We need to check the abbey immediately. Yes. Yeah. Uh, right so wait, what does the what does the regeneration do for him? It's a it's a ring of regeneration. It's in the what player's handbook. Like, like, yes, but what it did it give yeah. for him? Advantage. What say that again? What did it give for him? What does it? What does he get? Pardon his English. He hit all three. <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> pardon my English. Um, just slices its what, wings what does the ring of regeneration do? Is it in here? It's yeah, in it should, it should be in the player's hand. Alright, I'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. Continue. Continue, DM. Like, it's little GM. Like, whatever. Well, they're all sorts of magic tonight. I don't like this. No, I like it. Oh, P.S. I give the wand to the rogue. Is it not here? Yeah. No, it's in the other book. It's the DM's guide? It's in the DM's guide. I didn't bring the DM's guide. We'll have to I'll go get it. Week. It's over there. It's in the DM's guide. Okay, so so you're still heading north out of the graveyard, kind of back uh, away from the edge of the, the abbey, um, past the main building to another set of gatehouses. Okay. Uh, these are garden gatehouses. They stand empty, no guards or anything like that. You pass through the gatehouses into area 12, into a courtyard. Thick fog fills the courtyard swirls as, it, as if eager to escape. The courtyard is surrounded by 15-foot high curtain wall on which stands several guards with their backs to you, or so it seemed at first. It clear, it's clear now that these guards are merely scarecrows. Wooden doors to the north and east lead to the abbey's two wings. In the center of the courtyard is a stone well fitted with an iron winch to which a rope and bucket are attached. Along the perimeter, tucked under the overhanging wall, are several stone sheds with padlocked wooden doors as well as three shallow alcoves that contain wooden troughs. Two wooden posts pounded into the rocky earth have iron rings bolted to them, and chained to the one of them is a short humanoid with bat wings and spider mandibles. The quiet is shattered by horrible screams coming from the sheds. So they've walked you into a courtyard. Um, there is a creature tied to a post. The guards just kind of continue walking past them, and there's a shed from which there are screams. What kind of screams? Humanoid? Or I think we're about to get into a fight. Yeah. Whisper into everyone's mind. But um, what kind of screeches? Uh, inhuman, horrible, kind of animal noises, okay. but like, you know. I see you're keeping a nice zoo as well. Oh, the habit has been hard at work. Hard at work. While they're not looking, I steal the rope. Because I actually need the rope for my movie. Performing great magics and healing rituals. Protecting the village and making sure that um, the town is constantly safe and secure and has everything that it needs. That no intruders or evil forces enter the Okay? I stole the rope. Can't you, like, get into his mind yeah. anyway? The, the creature that they're escorting you past is a horrible creature, right? It's a bat-winged human with a spider face, right? It's got Yeah, it's mandibles. definitely evil. And they're walking past it like it's ordinary. 
They have no real. Why did you roll for they're not shocked at all. Well, they're so kind of they, weird too. So they're right and they're right 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 right. I mean, so your inside is like this is very not normal. The people down in the village below seem very you know, wash yourself, get clean, everything's cool. This is very creepy. So, um, are we walking past the shed, or are we walking towards the shed? You, you are walking... Because uh, I think we should just pass the shed. So, so you, you kind of walked... Yeah, you've kind of walked into a courtyard. Imagine this is the courtyard. They're escorting you this way. There are creatures spiked here, and there are sheds back here. Okay. All right. Continue. So that's one uh, well, why don't you guys wait here and we'll go find the abbey? Uh, he should be he should be just in here. Why don't we follow him? Why don't we go with you? I don't want to be in this courtyard. Yeah. <laughs> why don't we go with you? So the, the noise is hard for us. Can yeah. We, can we come with you? Um, the abbot may be deep in prayer. We don't want to disturb him. So why would you be in quiet? We'll we'll come in very quietly. We understand. We, at the gate, you were not quiet. Well, we will be quiet now. We, we understand now. No, no, wait here. We'll be right back. Um, you know, we're scared. Scared. No, but this is the Abbey! What could possibly happen here? I mean, are we prepared to win a whole bunch of us? Well, I have an ability to hide all of us right now so nothing can see us. And I just got the rope I know it's a cow. That's nothing! Oh my god! So I actually have this move called... Dory. Um, so, how many cultists are so you guys are, are standing here. The the bat-like creature, as you look closer, it may be a woman, a female bat-like creature. It starts flapping its wings, freaking out. It flies up about ten feet off the ground. It's yelling and screaming in a gibberish, and it appears that its mouth has been fused with some kind of like spider jaw. So it's 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 not making any sense, and it's trying to fly away, but it's on a t it's tethered to a pole. So it's gone up about fifty feet, and it's just kind of panicking. So they can't get at us right. from where they are. They're level spell slide. We're okay. Yeah. All right. So okay. They don't react at all to this. But it's terrifying. Uh, wait, wait, we are right here. We'll be right back. Okay. And they start walking fine. into the abbey. They start we'll heading see. this way. Uh, so you're in the courtyard. There's a well and there's some sheds. No. All right. Uh, do we want to but spread out or? Be there, so I can cast there. rope trip trick and um, hide all of us. And I just got the rope I needed to cast up. Okay. Uh, I can hide us no, all into it. So this this move's really fun. Uh, so do it. I touch a rope and it goes straight into the air. Okay. And we all climb it and we go inside of this hidden box and nothing can see us but we can see out of it. So we're now inside of a hidden box and we can see all over but nothing can see us or touch us or So you've cast rope trick? Yes. And everyone's gone up into the rope trick. Yeah. Do we want... I've got pretty good charisma. Let's just wait and see what happens. Okay. If he, they come back with him, we'll leave. But let's it's, go into the room. It's ten to ten. Can we stop right here in the abbey? Yes. Is that okay? Yeah. We're we'll we'll stop right here. So the abbot will will start next week right here with you guys up in there in the abbey coming abbot coming out of the abbey. Cool. I'm so Everybody excited! I just that? got my rope. We started late today, but so you know how I work for. You should always have a rope. That's like the first thing. Yes. We're having an employee screening on Wednesday, so I'm going to be doing the Warcraft movie. Oh. That is awesome. Question. It doesn't come out until the tenth. Are you free tomorrow? Because I'm off tomorrow. You're off tomorrow. Yes. Um, tomorrow they're having this okay. signing post thing for Overwatch. Okay. So now. Probably.